Good afternoon, my name is Frank Biggs and I'm with B Young RV in Milwaukee, Oregon, the greater Portland metro area of Oregon. And today I have the privilege of showing you the 35 QBA by Tiffin RV. The 35 QBA is the Allegro open road gas rig. This will be on the 24,000 pound Ford chassis, Tiffin overbuilds. So it's on a nice heavy chassis. It'll have the V10 three valve, 362 horses. Lots of power, 22 five inch Michelin tires. You'll see uh, uh, 255 80R 22.5s. You'll notice there's a driver's door here. Nice clean steps to walk up in instead of a piece of uh, chicken wire down there. This happens to be in the Rocky Mountain Brown, a very popular color. It's been a stronghold color for Tiffin for quite a while. Full body paint. Two coats, a baked on clear coat on here. And you'll see the nice service doors down here. These are the cafe style doors. Of course, that's the hydraulics for the HWH system. But you can see you have pass-through storage in there, up over. And you'll notice that there's hydrofoil underneath there. That adds insulation, soundproofing, boosts the R factor by 19. As far as I know, Tiffin is the only company to utilize that product in their Class A motorhomes. All right, you'll notice another door here, still, and LED lights in the basement here. This will be your service bay over here. You'll have full filtration water system. You can lay the hose in there. You can keep the hose hooked up. Drops out through the bottom, not out through a door. The other nice thing you'll notice about the Ford chassis is the exhaust is on this side, not on your awning side. Hoorah for Ford. Generator will be in here. This will be a 7,000 Onan, the leader in the industry. Of course, your 50 amp service hookup is back in here, the cord. Tiffin even gives you the 30 to 50 amp power cord. In case you're in a park that's only got 30 amp, which a lot of our Oregon State Parks, that's all they have. One more bay door over here. A little more storage, you'll notice the LED lights in there, really nice. One piece cap, and then a molded fiberglass roof, actual molded fiberglass roof. It's like a football helmet or a bathtub upside down, but the same material as football helmet, with two uh, walkways up there. Of course, the backup camera is integrated down underneath the eave up there, so less water and stuff. Gas fill from the backside, easy, no matter where you're at. You can tow 5,000 pounds, thereabouts. It is a 10,000 pound rated hitch though. Uh, I don't know of anybody else doing that, putting a, that heavy a hitch on a Class A gas motorhome. There is an extension for the ladder, it'll be in the bay. So you don't have to get so far up. Of course your furnace is here, we got 60,000 BTUs of furnace, plus we have a heat pump air conditioner on the roof. Central back, of course. This is the other side of the bay doors, so you have two of those there. A brand new latch for the outside TV, big TV in here, Panasonic, of course. Down underneath here, you'll have uh, some more hookups in case you want to put a TV outside. Nice big door. The famous Tiffin window here, trucker's window, I always call it. That's in case somebody's standing here at a stop sign. Uh, they're getting ready to walk, you don't run them over. And you notice the sideboard camera's up here so they stick out further instead of down on the body uh, putting into the sidewall here. So that's a big deal, that's a, a Tiffin uh, exclusive, far as I know. And uh, of course you got the diamond shield up here. And up front here we have easy access to check underneath the, uh, check your oil and stuff up underneath here. And uh, again, you'll see the hydrofoil or astrofoil up underneath here. And you'll see foam sprayed up in the corners. That's something that Tiffin does. No other manufacturer, uh, wherever there's a crack or in the chassis, fill them with foam. Plus with that hydrofoil between the floor and the frame, you'll have the quietest motorhome you've ever had. And you'll notice it's a one-piece windshield and it's set into the front cap um, so it can flex. It's set up automotive style. And this, the open road is one of the first coaches in the Tiffin line to get this new setup here. All right, let's go inside and check out this beautiful multi-purpose Class A motorhome from Tiffin RV. 
All right, let's look up at the front here. Of course, uh, Ford chassis, very well known chassis, leader in the industry. Uh, we do have a GPS system. Uh, this is a Kenwood, but it's driven by uh, Garmin. Of course, backup cameras here, and we have sideboard cameras. It's colored. HWH uh, leveling system, leader industry. Uh, we move into the kitchen. We do have a Euro chair uh, here with a footrest. I do have it bolted down here. This is where it stays, but you can move it wherever you want to. It will recline, as you can see. Nice pillow on there. We've got a lot of accent in here. Moving into the kitchen over here, of course you have a three burner cooktop. Everybody has one of them, right? Well, this is Avalite up here. This is a commercial grade material. We don't get cracking with it. A nice sink covers up here, stainless steel sink. Big one and a smaller one, look how deep those are. Window in the kitchen. Of course, the big uh, convection microwave here. Um, we haven't got time to set that up, a sharp. Uh, lots of room underneath here, place for a garbage can, lots of drawers. And by the way, this is real wood here. All this is real wood, these cabinets here. This isn't paper wrap, like a competitor's product. All right, look at that. And this is the English chestnut uh, cabinetry. It's one of the most popular, they also have alder. Um, but uh, this seems to be the most popular in here. And of course, this is in the uh, sunset interior. And we move over here. Again, uh, we'll have a uh, Panasonic TV right here. Nothing but Panasonic's through the coach. Lots of storage up here. Storage down here. This has a booth dinette, which you can make into a bed. Nice, I call it the dream dinette. You can just push that down. It is a dream dinette. And you'll notice that we have some nice drawers underneath there. They'll be on both sides. Roller bearing guides. Moving over to the sofa on this particular unit here. This will be a hide a bed. It's flex steel. Take pillows off, fold it out. Good to go. Uh, of course, we have the same shades over here. You have solar and night shades in here, MCD style. Nice deep cabinets, really long. Uh, of course, we have two ACs on here. We also have a forward one that's a heat pump. So uh, you have 15,000 up here. This is your intake. This is where the air comes out or heat if you're using a heat pump that's whisper quiet. So you have this much roof uh, between the air conditioning used. So these are very quiet to operate the AC in here or the heat pump. Moving along, of course, we've got a nice big uh, eight cubic foot refrigerator here with ice maker. This 2014, Tiffin came up in the open road before some of the other diesel pushers, higher end coaches, multiplex wiring. And as you notice when you came in, the main switch is down there. I can operate the hot water heater from here, the water pump from here, slide outs from here, main ceiling. So um, they're integrated wherever. So if I turn that off, I can turn them off just like that uh, instead of having light switches everywhere. All right, so that uh, multiplex wiring is a big deal. Moving into the bathroom, uh, we're gonna have a nice big bathroom in here with a, a garden style shower with a seat in it. You'll notice one piece molded fiberglass. That'll be on your uh, left hand side in here and some cabinets and of course big toilet with paper towel uh, holder and uh, a high speed fan in the bathroom. There's air conditioning duct and heat duct in here also. Oh, voila, we have bunks in here, two big bunks in here. Or you can use it for storage when you don't have the grandkids or extra people, hunting partners, fishing partners, or whatever. Uh, both of them, uh, we have LED lights up here for them. And we do have a DVD player up here, TV system, individual plug up up there. So they can plug in their phones or whatever to charge them up. You got some nice drawers underneath here. And there is a ladder that comes with this. It'll be underneath the bed up here. You'll notice this nice door to shut off the main cabin if the kids or somebody's sleeping. Of course, we have another big door. This is new for 14. No latches on the floor. It's all integrated. Talk about the cabinets in here. Well, there's a little bit more of the uh, multiplex wiring. Turn the master lights off right here in the bedroom. Lots of drawers. Six of big ones. Big cabinet in here. And this is your spec sheet in here. It'll talk about your appliances, serial numbers, 
and of course your cargo carrying capacity and uh, model number and everything. In here we got a nice big queen bed. That's an actual queen bed, 60 by 80. A lot of windows. We can get cross ventilation here. Nice cabinets up above. Beautiful accents with this. Uh, this is a mild uh, uh, pattern, the sunset. Um, it's one of the preferred patterns. And of course we do have a fan in here, which I can turn on up above from here. High speed, low speed, what do you think, huh? Keep the air circulating. All right, now we're gonna talk about TV in the back here, that's new. Panasonic TV, of course. Um, I will tell you that uh, the DVD player and uh, is up in the Ford cabin up there above the driver. Panasonic, it's got a bracket, I can turn it. Look at that, look at the depth in there in the bedroom. I can come out like that and turn that baby. Of course, Panasonic, of course, we can see real well. I can lock that back in place and turn that back up so we don't have it swinging out and traveling. Uh, there is this auto-locating satellite dish on board. There'll be a wine guard. Tiffin in 2014 does put the uh, direct TV box up there for you. Again, this is Frank Biggs with B Young RV in Milwaukee, Oregon, the greater Portland metro area of Oregon, right off of Highway 99, I-205, I-5. We have lots of Tiffin motorhomes. We have more in stock now than we've ever had. And we also sell uh, fifth wheels, new and used, travel trailers, uh, new and used, big toy haulers. And I welcome you to come to Be Young RV. And as they say at Be Young RV, come shopping today and you can be camping tomorrow. <laughs>